All right, ladies and gentlemen, my name is author Maria Desmondi, and I'm coming to you live from my home. Remember, I don't like you on video. I'm coming to you live from my home with my son, Dexter, because today Hi. we are going to show you an excellent activity you can do that teaches, do I'm going to teach you, that teaches you patience. The lighting is kind of weird in here. So here are the supplies that you need. Again, um, I'm a children's book author. I'm a mother of three. I'm a former teacher. And so um, I come on here live every week. I alternate between going live here on Thursdays and going live over in my private Facebook group called Empowering Kids with Character. And if you're not getting enough of me once a week, you can definitely um, get my free flash briefing on Amazon, where if you have an Amazon Alexa product, you can hear a one minute tip daily on empowering your children of all ages with positive character. So let's get started. Hi guys. <laughs> okay, so here are the different Beats. materials that you're gonna need for this activity. And I found this activity on Pinterest, of course. Um, no, buddy, you sit down. I'm going to stand up so I can be above you. So we have these pony beads. Um, yeah. You can also have these, like, this glittery kind of, like, I think these are called kind of like a sequin. Um, they also suggested glitter, but I actually don't like uh, the way glitter looks with something like this, so we're not going to do glitter. And then the last element that you need is glue, and you kind of need a lot of glue. So what yeah, is this thing? Elmo's this, glue. This is um, a lid. See, so that's the probably El fourth. We need Elmo's glue. That's Elmer's glue. So this is the fourth thing you're going to need is a lid. So what we're going to do is I'm going to have Dex pour the glue into the lid, and what we're making is I'm do it. a see-through sun catcher. Okay, so let me open this up for the little man. I can. Okay, use both hands, please. Okay, we're gonna pour it. Whoa. Whoa, keep going. Whoa, mama, and this is hard to do with one hand on the phone. Whoa, okay, let's see how that works. Pull it up. So you really wanna use a lot of glue because after um, a few days, the glue starts to shrink. So the reason this activity teaches patience is because it takes, wait for it, wait for it, three to four days for this to dry. And once it dries, your creation is gonna just pop right out of the container. We're gonna put stuff in here. And then what we'll do is we'll hang it on that window over there. And for those ladies and gentlemen watching, I'm, I'm I will in. actually post a picture of when I'm it is finished. Put. Hold on, buddy, we need to add a little more glue. I will post a picture in the comments below when it's finished. And if you're watching this on YouTube, I'll try to remember to post a picture there. Can All I right, so the now what we're going to do, yep, but we're going to try to make the letter D for your name. So he wanted to use blue. Let's use all different blues, and you said greens, right? So we're going to make the letter D. So go ahead. Let's start making the letter D. I don't know how to make D. In the glue. And then what we'll probably do is we'll end up sprinkling some of these sequins on it. And again, Dexter, you're going to have to wait not one day, not two days, but how many days? Three three days and that takes patience in itself the waiting and the waiting and the waiting so what's really important to teach our children when we're talking about patience is you want them to be able to match the word with a feeling um, so you want them to be able to say hey okay we're making cookies today and I have to wait 15 minutes for the cookies to come out of the oven waiting is called patience Waiting without anger is called patience, okay? Um, and again, like if you're at the grocery store and you're waiting in a long line, waiting in a long line without getting angry and frustrated is called patience. So again, those of you just tuning in, we are doing a home craft with glue, a lid, pony beads, and sequins, and it's making a sun catcher. It's going to take three to four days for the glue to dry, and then I will post in the comments below what it turns out to look like. Again, this is teaching our children the positive character trait of patience. So, thank you so much for tuning in, and I hope you will... I didn't finish it yet. No, you're still working on it. I hope you will um, check out Empowering Kids with Character over on Alexa as a flash briefing, and this is how it works. Alexa, what's my news from Empowering Kids with Character? Mm. It should work. <laughs> That's all you have to do. You have to say, Alexa, what's my news? Something's went wrong with Alexa. Alexa, what's the news? We're gonna have to reset her. Okay, I'm signing off.